I've got my current favorite Starbucks drinks, an iced peach green tea. It's seriously delicious. And today we're gonna talk about my current favorites. If you're looking for some travel essentials or must have beauty products for the body, you've gotta watch this video. Let's get started. Wanna hang with me? I'm not really looking for a friend, so I wanna go ahead and start with my absolute favorite body products. These are all from Necessaire. I've been raving about this brand for years at this point on my channel. I do wanna talk about these four products specifically today. This is actually their body ritual set. Yes, you can purchase them all individually. If you did, it would be $145, but you can actually get the set for 80. And I did partner with Necessaire for today's video. So I do have a coupon code that you can stack on top of that. I'll pop it on the screen, but I'll also put all of the details in the information box and you can use that to save an extra 10% off the set price. Um, I've talked about all of these products over the years on my channel, but I do wanna go through them really quickly, starting out with their, let's start with the body wash. So I use their body wash literally every single day. I've got some empties. I just opened up a fresh bottle. Um, I love their body wash. It has niacinamide on it, so it cleanses, it nourish, it also softens the skin. It's just my absolute favorite. It is just so gentle on the skin. I truly, truly love this body wash. This is the eucalyptus. They do have unscented as well. The eucalyptus is my favorite though. I really, really love this. This is obviously part of the set. And like I said, I have been buying this just on repeat ever since I started using it at this point, maybe going on two years. Next up, I wanna talk about their body exfoliator. This is a two-in-one exfoliator. It's got AHA, it's got BHA, so it softens, it smooths, it exfoliates. On a regular basis, I use this in my routine once or twice a week just to maintain the softness of my skin and to kind of just exfoliate on a regular basis. I recently went to Cancun. I knew I wanted my skin to be the best it could be because I knew I was gonna be in a swimsuit, I was gonna be getting in and out of water, I was gonna be in the sun all day, and I just wanted my skin to feel and look beautiful. So the week leading up to my trip, I actually used this every single day, and I will say my skin was probably the best it has ever been. I truly, truly love this and highly, highly recommend if you are not exfoliating your body, this is my go-to product, I love it. Next up, let's go ahead and talk about their body serum. I love the fact that they have a body serum in this routine because I think it helps remind us that we have to take care of the skin on our body the same way that we take care of the skin on our face. And if you noticed at the beginning of this video, I didn't say body products, I said beauty products for the body travel essentials or must have beauty products for the body. I love in general what they have done. They really have created a beauty routine for our body. These products are just as effective and they're clean as the products that we would put on our face. I truly just love these products. This has hyaluronic acid, so it's gonna help uh, plump the skin and, and replenish and hydrate. It is just such a beautiful, beautiful product. I will put this on underneath or cocktail it with their body lotion. This is another one of those products that I use every single day. I have one of them in my nightstand and I put this on my skin before I go to bed. I don't always cocktail or layer the serum. I usually do this during the day because it also gives just like the most beautiful glow whenever you add the serum. But this also has niacinamide in it as well. So of course it's gonna hydrate, it's gonna soften, and you've got that niacinamide in it as well. It's just a beautiful, beautiful lotion. I like using this on my skin at night because it is so nourishing, but I also use it in the day Daytime. And what I love about using it in the daytime is it doesn't, this is unscented, it's fragrance free. It doesn't compete with any perfume that I layer over the top of it as well, which is really, really nice. So like I said, you can get all four products. You got the body lotion, the body serum, the body exfoliator, as well as the body wash. And if you use my coupon code, you can save an extra 10% off. While you're shopping around though, I just have to give a little, like it just, I have to mention it. Um, get their deodorant. I have been using their deodorant for years. I have talked about, I've raved about that deodorant for as ever since I bought it. Um, get that as well, save 10%. Trust me, you're gonna wanna get it. But I'll link all these products down below. I'm just a huge, huge fan of Necessaire. Their products, like I said, they're clean, they're super effective, and they're just, 
they're just the best. Trust me, you will not regret it at all. All the info will be down in the info box. Speaking of perfumes, I have two that I wanna talk about this month because I fell in love with both. I was trying to decide which one do I wanna talk about in this month's favorites and I, I couldn't decide, so I have to talk about both. So first up is the Chanel Gabrielle. I'm still kicking myself that I bought the small bottle instead of the large bottle. The large bottle is always a better buy, but I really didn't know if I was gonna love it, so I was still kinda of taking a risk buying it. I love this one. I actually ended up taking this to Cancun because it was just the perfect size. I uh, really, really love this one. If you love the Chanel perfumes that I've mentioned, you have to give this one a try. Keep in mind, there are two different versions of the Chanel Gabrielle perfume. I did not like the other one. This is the only one I liked. The one that I'm linking down below for you it is just such a beautiful, beautiful scent. Um, oops, the lid fell off. And next up is another perfume by MFK. Again, this is one of those brands. Um, I've talked about this. I just have to mention it because I will say I had never spent this much on perfume prior to really, really falling in love with this brand. I get it, like I get it now. I, and I remember someone was like, oh, you should try the Baccarat, it's like 500 bucks. I was like, what, you're crazy. I would never do that. Why would I do that when I can get the large bottle of Coco Mademoiselle, right, for like what? I don't even know, 200, whatever it is now. That's ridiculous. Um, I, I get it, I, I get it now, okay, I, I understand. But the All Rose, this was on my wish list. I got it and I love it. It's so good. If you're looking for a good spring summer scent, a little bit lighter, a floral, this one is perfection. I definitely have a few fashion favorites that I wanna mention this month. First up is this two-piece set. You've got the little bike shorts, you've got the little crop top. This is actually um, the set that I just ordered, but I now have it in three different colors. I love it so much. I ordered the brown set as well as like the uh, ivory set, and I ended up using both of those set on travel days. On the way to Cancun, I wore the brown set with a blazer and sneakers, and I felt so cute and just like pulled together, but it was so comfortable. Um, and yes, if you get a good oversized blazer, like a boyfriend fit on a blazer, it can be so comfortable. And then on the way home, I wore the cream set with a plaid, like oversized plaid shirt and sneakers. And again, I felt so cute. I felt so, so cute, but again, so, so comfortable. These sets are just the cutest thing. Uh, they're really, really, really flattering and just, so, so comfortable to wear. And I just, like I said, throw on, you can throw on a cardigan a little bit later into like fall or if even like in the, the evening, if you're around a fireplace or something like that, these sets are just so, so comfortable. I did get the sets in a medium and I think they fit great, but I think overall they fit true to size. Um, but I really, really love the way these fit. I highly recommend them. And they're from Amazon. It was like 30, I think they were like, they were different, different prices depending on the color. I think they ranged from like 36 to like, $40, so super, super affordable as well. And speaking of Amazon and sets, I also had to mention this two-piece set. You've got like an oversized, like off the shoulder um, knit, do I wanna call it a sweater? I mean, it's not really, it's like a summer sweater, right? Really, really lightweight. And then you've got the coordinating, matching uh, drawstring shorts. I also got these in a medium. I ended up ordering the small and the medium. The small fit, I just liked how loose the medium was. And I do think that the shorts uh, just looked a little bit better in a, in a size up. Um, I also ended up ordering these in like two or three more colors. Love this set. I will pop on a picture of me wearing the, the Set as well. I wore the set one day and I actually wore the top another day. This is just one of my absolute favorite finds when it comes to Amazon, you know, Amazon fashion finds. Again, super affordable. I think this was around $38. $42, somewhere around there, depending on the price or depending on the color that you get. Um, but I love this set. It was super comfortable. I actually wore it with a sticky bra, which I'm going to go ahead and mention next that I truly fell in love with. And I didn't think would ever be something that I would ever be able to wear, but I was wrong. Like this set, it's, it's so good. You got to get it. Okay. So we're going to talk about the sticky bra really quickly. Um, I am a, just for size reference, I am a 32 triple D or a 34 double D. Those are the two sizes that work the best for me. They're sister sizes. And, um, so because of that, I just never thought that I would ever 
want to wear a sticky bra, right? Like I needed just a little bit more support. I decided to go and give it a try because I had purchased a couple of tops that really you couldn't wear a regular bra with. And I was like, okay, it doesn't hurt to order one. If I don't like it, I can return it or, you know, whatever, no big deal. It's it, at least I can try. Um, so I decided to order one off of Amazon and it worked. It, it worked, you guys, it worked. Um, so these, uh, my husband called them chicken cutlets. Uh, they actually don't add any size. They are, I wouldn't say thin, but they're, they're not gonna add any size. So keep that in mind. They just are a like formed cup. And this is so that the stickiness um, stays sticky. And yes, it is reusable. I had a, several of you ask about that. It's not a one-time use situation. So if the cups get dirty, you can actually wash it with soap. Once they fully dry, you put this little thing back on it just so that the stickiness doesn't get like fuzzy or dust on it. But let me show you how you, uh, you put it on. Um, it's kind of genius to be honest. So you're going to put this on one cup starting from the outside in, and then you're going to put the other one on, right? Then you're going to put it on and then you're going to bring them together and close it like this. So it gives you cleavage, you guys. It works. So does it lift them up? Not not really, a, a, a tiny, tiny, tiny bit. It gives a little bit of support, but it gives enough support that you feel comfortable. They're not, you know, they're not bare. So um, they're just, it's more comfortable than well, I don't know about more comfortable, but it's definitely more support than nothing, right? But it's not gonna give you the full support of a regular bra. I will say I loved it. I ended up wearing these, how many days did I wear these on vacation? I think two or three of the outfits that I wore, I ended up wearing these and I just felt so good. I felt really, really good. Um, I will say the first time you try them, you might need to adjust them a little bit, but as with anything, you're going to have to find like how it fits for your particular shape and size and everything. Um, I ended up ordering a D and a double D and both of them work for me. It just depends on how much coverage and how much support that you want. So obviously you have a bigger cup, you're going to be able to go a little bit more under and then bring them up just a little bit more. And then once you get them on, let me just like a little bit of a, a trick. Once you get it on, and if you want a little bit more support, what I did was I unstuck it and then I, I unstuck it a little bit and then I pulled them up and then I stuck it back. So it's kind of like the top of your skin. It, it's almost like boob tape, like a little bit. It's almost like boob tape. So just a little trick. If you decide to get them, put them on, make them comfortable and then unstick, lift, stick them back. It works almost like boob tape and they do not move. Seriously, you guys, I highly, highly recommend these. I'll link them down below. Okay, while we are talking about undergarments, I'm gonna go ahead and talk about these. I don't, <laughs> I don't show these very often just because you never know who's watching, right? You, you just never know. But I, I love them so much that since we're talking about sticky bra, we're gonna go ahead and share uh, my current favorite thong. I love them, you guys. I ended up ordering like, I don't even know, nine pair, just an insane amount of pairs because I fell in love with them so much. Um, I have been wearing these same Soma thongs for years. I've talked about them here on my channel. I love those thongs, I really, really do. But I don't know what happened. I don't know what happened, but all of a sudden I needed they just weren't as comfortable as they had been in the past. Um, and so I wanted something just a little bit thinner, a little bit thinner. Uh, I decided to give these a try. And they, they're kind of like, they're so thin, like this is the back. Um, I wear them in a small, they're so stretchy, so stretchy, you guys. Um, so yeah, if you're just looking for like something um, for, that just doesn't, you, I, I don't have to pull at these or move them around or tuck at them because they're so small, like they can only exist where they exist, which is very, very minimally. Um, so because of that, I actually find that I almost forget that I'm wearing them, right? So if you're kind of like struggling with that as well, like a less is more kind of situation, I, I would give these a try. They're like three for 36. So they're kind of pricey when it comes to, to underwear, but um, you know, they're, I, I love them. I'll link them down below. Okay, let's go ahead and dive in to uh, my favorite handbag for travel. I get asked quite a bit, especially around this time of year, 
about what bag I recommend traveling with. So do I travel with my luxury pieces? Yes, I do. It depends on where I'm going and it depends on who I'm going with, but yes, I do. But I always like to at least have one option that isn't logo-y, right? Like a handbag option that isn't logo-y. I have uh, some lower end bags in my collection or even I just keep like, I have like this black bum bag that I really, really like. But when I'm looking for something stylish that is not logo-y, but also very, very, very versatile, um, this is actually my favorite. I really, really love this. This is from Sunrev. I've had this one for a while. I really, really like it. The quality of it is amazing, but my absolute favorite thing about this bag is just the overall design of it. Not only is it super, super cute, I do think it's adorable, but the overall design of it just makes it extremely vers versatile, especially when it comes to travel. So obviously, as you can see, you can carry it like this, like a clutch. So if you're gonna go out to dinner, um, you can carry it like this. If you um, are at, at a beach vacation, you've got that large tote with all your pool and you know beach side things, you can throw this inside with just your main essential. So whenever you go to dinner at, at the end of the night, you can grab this and this is like the perfect um, dinner bag but you also have the strap option. So there are a couple of different ways you can do the strap. You can attach it to the back here, which makes it like a bum bag. So you can wear it across the chest. You can wear it on, on you know, around the waist, just like a typical waist bag, um, which is great. Obviously that's a great way to wear a bag for travel. It's just really comfortable. Or you could attach it to here on the inside and wear it like a long strap to wear it a uh, cross body or longer on the shoulder. Size wise, it's not very big. It's just gonna have your main essentials. You got a zipper pocket back here. You got a little card holder th there. So you can put like your credit card and your ID right here. And then of course your essentials. It's always been perfect and enough for me whenever I am on vacation. And this is the bag that I wore to like dinner and stuff like that. Uh, it comes in a ton of different colors. I of course went for this uh, camel color. I think it's called chestnut, I believe, um, but I love it. So if you're looking for just a good bag to have available for these kind of situations, it's, it's just so, so versatile. So I just highly recommend this overall. Speaking of travel, I had to mention my packing cubes in this month's favorites because I love them. Um, the color is scrumptious. It just coordinates so well with my luggage. Um, I did have a whole different packing solution that I had and I did love it. I'm not complaining whatsoever about the previous solution that I had. I just wanted to try something different. I really just wanted to try something different. And I had honestly never used actual packing cubes. So when I saw that they became available in this color, I had to try them and I love them. Um, I actually did a, what I packed into my carry on on TikTok, um, sharing how much I was able to fit in my carry on. And it was all because of these packing cubes. So don't be too deceived. I have two sets here. So keep that in mind. There are eight actual, or 10 packing cubes here. Each set comes with five and it's like $60 or something like that, 60, $65. It's a really great price, I think. Um, and it comes with the large one, of course. And then it comes with two of these like smaller ones with the mesh. And then it comes with this one, two of these larger ones with the mesh. And then it comes with like a little toiletry bag that doesn't have any mesh. It's just kind of like a larger zipper pocket. They're just so practical. I probably didn't need to get two sets, but because I love my luggage so much, I just didn't want to be in a situation where I needed more packing cubes and I had to get another set like down the line and they not not match <laughs> i just i then i would have had to buy a whole it just would have been a thing right so i went ahead and just got two sets and i'm glad that i did but yes you get five pieces for the 60 65 bucks and they really are just incredible i really really love these and the size options speaking of travel i had to mention my carry-on in this month's favorites i have been using this same carry-on for I think it's been about four years. I love it so, so much. Every single time I share it, people are so confused how I could use white luggage. I shared on stories recently on Instagram how I cleaned this after Cancun. Yes, they get dirty, but they clean up so, so well. And if you're afraid of white, 
They come in a ton of different colors. I know one of you got navy. I know some of you have gotten pink. There are so many different colors, so you don't have to get white. I just like the way it looked. I like it so much, I bought the uh, checked size. So I have both sizes. I have the matching vanity case. I really just in general love this whole collection. It looks so chic so like luxurious and expensive and i really think the price is not bad at all it's really lightweight and it holds a ton so just in general it's amazing luggage so i really really highly recommend this i'll link this down as well below and then like i said i also really like the vanity case but all that will be like kind of linked with the collection if you check it out it's just such a beautiful beautiful piece and if you were afraid about checked luggage then get the carry-on size only that's the one i started out with and then i later bought the check size and last up i wanted to mention this prada card holder i always get asked about slgs so i really really want to mention this because if you are looking to try a new SLG, this might be one of my absolute favorites that I found in a very, very long time. I did recently pull my cards and stuff out of this because I ordered the Louis Vuitton Zippy Coin uh, purse and I switched over to that. Um, but I still highly recommend this. I actually really, really am loving the Zippy one. I, I like the fact that that one matches all my other SLGs, but if I'm being honest, I actually still think I prefer this one, but they're, they're, they're very, very close in how much I like them. Um, I will say, I will link this one down below, but it's gonna be slightly different. I actually think the version that I'm gonna link down below is a little bit better than this one. Um, and it's because it doesn't have this extra flappy. You don't really need it. It's more aesthetic, but it still has the three card holder slots on this side. It has the main card holder slot on this side, and it still has the zippy part on this side. It is just such a practical piece. So if you're using like, let's say a regular card holder, right? That which is what I was using, but I needed just a little bit something more and you just need a little bit something more, but you don't want a full size option for your smaller handbags. This is so perfect because you can carry your main like card and ID here. You can carry like insurance information, maybe stamp cards back here. And then you can even put like, um, if you have any cash and if you get, have any change or whatever, you can put that here. Not a lot. I wouldn't put it to a ton, um, but you, it literally can be the perfect, literally most perfect mini wallet. I just love it so much. So I'll link this down below, but like I said, it is going to be a slightly, it's just going to look like this. No, no button, obviously. It's gonna look just like this. I mean, it comes in three different colors. It comes in this color, which I love. It comes in black, and then it comes in pink as well. It is seriously just the most practical little mini wallet, and I just think it's so, so adorable. So that is it, you guys. This month's favorites, they're all gonna be linked down below for you, and if you're new to my channel, my name is Amanda. Make sure to follow me on Instagram, Facebook, TikTok, all the places I do outfits of the day. The day. I do fun videos on TikTok. Um, so make sure to follow me in other places, but make sure to hit that subscribe button here and that notification button so you don't miss any future fashion and luxury videos here as well. Thanks again to Necessaire. Make sure to check out all the info box for the pieces that I shared as well as the Necessaire coupon code that I do have for you guys. You can save 10% on their entire website. Grab the body ritual set, but make sure to grab the deodorant as well. And I will see you guys in the next one. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye. Cause I